Hi, I'm Madame Pamita, and I love teaching about magic. If you have a question about spells, the law of attraction, spirituality, witchcraft, Slavic folk magic, spirits, divination, you can join me on Sundays at the Live Magic Q&A where we record an episode of my podcast, Magic and the Law of Attraction, and then I answer your questions on anything mystical or magical live over Zoom. Just go to spellsquad.com to get the link to join me in the clubhouse. And don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and click the bell icon so you get a gentle, magical reminder and you'll be the first witch to see whenever anything new goes up. Here's a great tidbit from one of our past Q&As answering a really important spiritual question. Okay, so Megan has a question. I'm curious as to what withering spells can do and how to go about them. Withering spells are banishing spells is another way to say ban. You're trying to get something to shrink something, right? So that could be something like maybe you're trying to shrink a tumor, like in a health spell, you're doing a visualization or work to, to shrink a tumor for a friend who has is going through cancer, right? You could um, think about that and do that kind of work in a withering spell. You might also want to do, I mean, a withering spell could be curse work, right? I don't want someone to prosper. So I'm going to wither their prosperity. Not a, not a high, highly enlightened way to work, but um, like, like nobody's prosperity is any of your business. It's like you can be prosperous and they can be prosperous too. So I don't advise it, but you do you. Um, a withering spell can also be done as like a banishing, you know, like I'm wanting to, you know, my, my partner, I'm, you know, I'm married to someone and my partner is running around with someone else. And I want to wither that relationship so that they are with me, you know? So you could wither that relationship. So wither is just another word for banishing. You're trying to shrink something, you know, in some way and banish it in some way. So you could use banishing oil. You could use the herbs for banishing, you know, things like brew is really great for banishing. Black pepper is great for banishing. These are all things that you can use. Uh, red peppers, great for getting something out as well. Salt, just, you know, salt is good for clearing out something as well. And those can all be used in withering spells. So the idea of the withering is like more over time, shrinking something over time as a banishing could be a one-time thing and be banished. So it's just a sort of a variation on a banishing spell. So unless there's some other form of withering spells that I don't know about. So, but that's what I see it as. 